What is up, guys? Welcome back to Armored Core 6 Fires of Rubicon. Let's get after it. So we'll do Eliminate Honest Brute first. We just fought Honest Brute literally a minute ago, but we'll do it here again. I'll cut to the chase. This is about the Ice Worm. That institute relic you had a run-in with. The corpse might stand a chance if it were just the PCA they were teaming up against. But that monster is a whole other story. You can't just throw bodies at it. The thing that makes it such a pain in the ass is its perpetual reactive shield. Coral Tech. Takes advantage of the coral's directivity. Ordinary weapons can't touch it. So let's get extraordinary. All right, Carla. I can make you something that'll punch a hole in that shield. Big gun? But I'll need you. Oh, hell cannon, big gun. You'll be heading to Grid 012. One of the first sectors they built. And it's barely holding up. That's where a little rat who betrayed R.A.D. is hiding out. Goes by the name of Honest Brute. His AC Milktooth was built by us, so it's only flaws that it's piloted by him. Yeah. When he ran from RAD, he didn't just take credits in tech. He also took a secret project of mine. And that secret project is what we'll need to bust open the Ice Worm shield. Alright, let's take him down. So... I like the assault armor, at least in PvE. It's good. I'm sure it works well in PvP if you use it correctly, because you're not in, you're not exposed in the same way that you were in Four and Four Answer, because you don't turn into like a paper robot at that point. Um, <clears throat> so I like the assault armor. Right, Ev. It's not your shield in this one, so it works a little differently. Old style AC one grenade launcher, baby. Is that what he has? This is the first game you've, you've legit used a grenade launcher in. I've used one in every single one of the games because I love the grenade launcher. You ready for this, tourist? No one's gonna miss Brute. And we all stand to gain. Oh, it's what you get. Oh. The fact they brought actually brought back something from all the AC gens is very good. Yeah, I agree. Activating combat mode. It's like a love letter to the series. All right, tourist. I'll tell you where to go. Welcome, tourist. It's a delight to enjoy the company of a visitor from so far away. Brute. We're here to take back what you stole from us. Oh, heavens. You're a friend of Carla's. Splendid. Any friend of Carla's is a friend of mine. Where are we going? Here's to new beginnings. By all means, be my guest. See what I mean, tourist? We need to go deep down. The suicide bots are back. That damn freak's using my toys like they were his. What is that? Make sure you keep clear of the laser sensors. They're set to activate the enemy machines. A new friend from afar, just for me. What joy! Be still, my oh, heart. Oh fuck me! Is that him right there? With the lights on? No. I'm waiting for you, friend. Fidgeting anxiously before the big dance. I do hope I'll keep up, but the anticipation is part of the fun. Yeah, I should know that was gonna happen. That was dumb. Alright, that thing's done now. Slow. 
Oh god. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? He's freaking me out a little bit. I know, Milktooth. I can't wait either. He's talking to his AC. He seems rather strange. I mean, you are talking to us through our mind, which is also strange. But... The enemy's deploying a shield. We need to get behind it. I hate to see my babies get scrapped like this, you know. <laughs> well, don't be shy. Smash them up. It'll help me with my R&D. There's your way in. Hold on, there's more guy right there. We should keep an eye out for traps. They'll be much more dangerous in tight corners. Oh shit. I've done my best to welcome you. Ooh. I do hope you'll enjoy your stay, Rand. I want this chest. I got bad cook. Oh, I wonder if it's a flamethrower. Where am I going? Oh. Jump down there and we've got him cornered. Don't forget, the guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. Alright, here we go. Is this place some kind of hangar? Target AC must be nearby. Ah, my new friend. You're here at last. Hi. Leave me alone. Ah, oh, Carla. You've introduced me to such wonderful people. Wonderful things. Shut him up, tourist. The sweet melody of the generator. How Milkshoe's heart sings. Oh, come on. Repair kits remaining. Thank you, Jarvis. Sometimes if you press the wrong button, don't realize it. AP at fifty percent. How milk tooth weeps. How the rail cannon weeps. God, that fucking attack is so annoying. Fucker. Might offer flowers if I could find them. He has that spread bazooka thing on his back. I'm assuming there's no checkpoints for this mission. Oh, there is. Wonder where it's at. Jump down there and we've got him cornered. Oh, okay. Don't forget, the guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. Is this place some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. Ah, my new friend. You're here at last. Brute! Ah, oh, Carla. You've introduced me to such wonderful people. Wonderful things. Shut him up, tourist. The sweet melody of the generator. How milk tooth's heart sings. Dog, what are you talking about? I just got chainsawed in the back. One, repair 
air kit remaining. I can't see my fucking AC through the fire. So I can't tell what weapon I have on sometimes. AP at 50%. AP at 30%. Oh, he healed. Slow. slow. Quick, quick, slow. Let's trip the light fantastic friend. Aren't we all? AP. God damn it. That was your last dance, friend. The biggest casualty in this game, debt. Yeah. One thing is, is that you get uh, Gen 1 AC parts and in the description says the pilot tends to like it for the bulk and simple design, which might be a nice thought for the Gen 1 lovers. Maybe, yeah. Wait, you get Gen 1 AC parts? When do you, Wait, when do we get those? Why are you clapping for him, Aldizen? Don't clap for him. Jump down there and we've got him cornered. Whose side are you Don't on forget, anyway? The guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. Is this place some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. Ah, my new friend. You're here at last. Brute! Ah, oh, Carla. You've introduced me to such wonderful people. Wonderful things. Shut him up, tourist. Where is he at? Uh, that AC at RAD, tourist. Don't underestimate it. Oh, there he is. Shit. From their mother. Oh, they must miss Carla so. I weep too. Don't encourage him. This fucking dude. AP. Slow. Slow. Quick, quick, slow. 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 Quick, quick, slow. Let's trip the fantastic. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Trying. There we go. God damn. My friend, this is a gift. Fucking weirdo. Through the fire emblems we, we carry on. Worm hunting. I think we picked that weapon up actually, which is kind of cool. So it's not so much that it does a lot of damage, but you can't see what's going on during it. Yeah, I think his mind was a little fried. Pulled too much coral up in there. Yeah, I'm get yep, flamethrower. Bad cook. Good name for it. And we finished the hunt, I guess. And we got the Javelin Beta. It's a detonating missile launcher. Cool. Message. This is Chatty Stick, RAD. Thanks for putting down Brute. The Chief's already in the workshop tweaking the rail cannon, and I've never seen her happier to be at work. That is all. Later, tourist. I kind of like all the different, um characters we've met so far. They're all pretty well. I mean, just a little bit of dialogue you have from each of them. They're they're fun. This this thing is really weird. The flamethrowers were weird in all the Armored Core games though, so I'm not surprised by that to be honest with you. Where are the new blades? I want some blades. Oh, that's the new missile right here? Yeah. 
Special missile launcher developed by All Mine created a chain of delayed explosions along with missiles along the missile's trajectory, allowing for sustained impressive fire even when against targets to manage to evade the initial missile. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, it does sound kind of weird now reading it. So it leaves a bunch of explos like ex explosives behind the missile's path. That's some PvP shit right there, it sounds like. Oh, we gotta go and click on this one too. All right, better for big targets. I can imagine so, yeah. All right, time for the next mission. So you said to do defend the old spaceport last. So we're gonna do uh, retrieve data. So historic data recovery. Uh, we're gonna salvage historic data scattered throughout the subterranean level. Raven, I have a personal request to ask you. It's about the Engelbert Tunnel, which is to be shut down after it was hit by a coral surge. Through there. I want to go there and survey the area. Even before the coral surge, that place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. As I'm sure you're aware, I have no resources with which to pay you. But I can propose an alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. You never expected a ghost to want you to do survey work. I don't think she's a ghost necessarily. I don't know what she is. I mean, somehow she's talking through us, but she obviously interacts with people. Walter thinks you've gone on a geological survey. Thank you for doing this for me, Raven. Like, how is she interacting with things if she's like in the coral? You know what I mean? I guess the corals and everything. I don't know. Main system. Activating combat mode. Let's get started, Raven. I've already located several wrecks that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send the marker data. Bug? Oh, those aren't bugs. They're just little robots that look kind of like bugs in shape. But they're not bugs. You're not a bug! You're a worker drone! PC craft data. I'll exchange it for credits and send them to you later. Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. Oh, okay, we're all using flamethrowers now, that's the thing. That's what all the cool kids are doing? Cool. I love that for you. There's probably a hunt in here. So, Vanda, you think there's five wrecks in total? This seems valuable, too. I'm so glad this is an older generation of AC. Are you a reference to like Armored Core 2, maybe? No. 
the lost uh, lost auto transcription for a voice log recorded by Professor Nagai, the Rubicon Research Institute director. No, the coral tide is rising at an abnormal rate. This resonance it, it suggests some kind of mutation. Run the calculations. How much time do we have? Forty-seven hours, two minutes, and sixteen seconds. We still have time. Deploy Ibis. According to the timestamp, this was recorded two days before the fires of Ibis. This seems to be about the warning signs of the calamity, right before it struck. Well, Ibis is the final boss of Silent Line, so clearly he has something to do with this. Yeah, Armored Core 2 looking boy, I agree. All right, this appears to be from the writings of Thumb Dolmayan, a father of the Liberation Front. The father of the Liberation Front. How long has it been since I first saw her voice? Fear not, she said. There will always be plenty. She told me this as I was imbibing Rubicon's blessings one fateful day. If I were you, I'd never allow this, I replied, and I was never and I was forever shamed by my ashamed by my deceit. So he saw her words. That's not a good sight or thing to this see. This seems to be a recording of Domayan, the Liberation Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal. Why are the why are the bugs angry? you're bugging them they're more like worker drones i guess that they're not actual bugs unfortunately if they're a meta in this game i will uh gift 50 subs to the channel if an amita shows up probably mr wreck yeah, if you guys see a reference to an older Armored Core game that I happen to miss, let me know, because I really want to see all of them. You have a room-sized ant. I don't think we're gonna I don't think we'll get that, but you never know. I'm stuck on a rock. Another old research institute, I see. Definitely reminiscent of Armored Core 2. Assistant number one has lost his mind. His research has utterly consumed him. Granted, there may be some logic to see Paul's sensory augmentation of human subjects, but no ethical scholar would ever dare cross that point of no return. Mankind is driven mad by possibilities. What does Coral represent, if not sheer potential? You forget which, well, you forget, uh, that was in Armored Core 1, Ev. It would suck to be an MT pilot in the universe because you're strong, but one any day you and your buddy could just explode, right? Uh, my, my AC's giving you a stray red vibes energy. This is about the first augmented humans. The same coral technology that I could see that. You. But without it, we never would have made contact. I'm not picking up any more data stores. If this outing has made you think about Rubicon's past or the nature of coral, then it was all worth it. Interesting. I suppose. Yeah, it was Armored Core 1 with the ants. They had grenade launchers on their back. <laughs> the, the, the queens did. 
one new message. Kaiju size, Ant. I don't remember that, Ev. What kept you, 621? You're a famous mercenary now. Time to act like one. Just get some rest. That's the important thing. Okay, Endeavor. Make contact. Oh, no. The Tenties. Oh, yeah. In Armored Core 3, yeah, there's a giant spider. Well, spider looking thing. All right, here is the final mission for this little group of them. Defend the old spaceport. <clears throat> Defend the old spaceport and prevent the recapture. It's recaptured by the Planetary Closure Administration. Got a job for you, 621. We've received a request from the Archibus Group. Raven, this request comes from our subsidiary, Schneider. It concerns the Bertram spaceport, which you and V4 brought under our control. We've received intel that a stranded PCA fleet is planning to retake the base. Your objective is to intercept the PCA and defend the spaceport. We've deployed an MT squad to support you. Use them as you see fit. Friends, more friends. That concludes the briefing. Good luck. All right, Ev. Thanks for stopping by. Have a wonderful uh, rest of your evening. Yeah, the uh, the ants that I grenade the launches PCA the shot of electricity. Be fighting to win. Six two one. Don't forget you have MT backup. I mean, it's better than nothing. We normally don't get friends. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. Wait, something's not right, 621. What? The battle's over already. Find out what's going on. Here we go. Great, I can't wait. Uh... Hello. Do you read me, Raven? Oh! I've identified the target. That's the mercenary who took your name. Oh, shit! Let's see how far they can fly. Aw, oh, here we go, dude! On borrowed wings. Time to fight Trailer Man. Oh yeah. That AC do all this. Whoa, you better quit zipping around, buddy. We're not here to take back the Raven Day. However, we will see if you can do it justice. Hmm, I don't like this. Looks like we found your license's original owner. Tie up the loose end, 61. Uh, okay. Oh God. Probably shouldn't have traded right there. You're full health! Yes, Raven, I feel it too. This mercenary has potential. The will to choose. AP at 50 percent AP at 30 percent. Woo, we got him! Raven, we can still Oh shit, is he dead?
Damn. Nightfall is here prepared to die. Actually, they died. So, prepare for trouble and make it double. You killed a raven, you're now nine ball. <laughs> we got ourselves a deal, Handler Walter. Hey, there's Michigan. Michigan. So, Archibus met us halfway. I gave them the heavy warship fleet. In exchange, Balaam's in charge of putting down the beast. They also offered some top vespers. <laughs> Guess they don't trust us. Better than nothing. I'll provide what support I can, too. Yeah, you're mad scientists. R.A.D. or whatever. And that hound of yours. Michigan, don't underestimate 621. That hound always delivers. That was a pretty cool fight, though. I, I wonder... If that's gonna tie back in again or something like there, there's got to be something else going on there right with nightfall maybe I've looked into the other Raven yeah the independent mercenary who attacked you it turns out that Raven isn't an individual call sign it's a title passed down generations of mercenaries who champion the free will Raven stands for references they choose what to fight for and take to the skies in flight if that's what being a raven means, then that's the name I want to keep calling you, Raven. Oh, that's so cool. That might not have been the cleanest fight, but that was the most epic fight you had this entire playthrough. Thanks! Oh, dude, we got this... We have Nightfall's version of it now. Where it's actually filled in. Cool. One new message. Time for work, 62. This next mission's all or nothing. Make sure you attend the briefing. All right. Well, do I have an option to skip it? Oh, uh, okay. Oh, we probably have to use this. The Archibus Corporation is issued with the following prototype part. The VE-60 SNA Stun Needle Launcher. Wait, do I have to use that? Anti-ice worm weapon designed by Archibus ADD. That's a big ass gun. Ugh! I don't have the energy for this shit. Um I assume we're supposed to use this. You have a theory about this game, you think this game might be connected to the Last Raven in some way, especially because in Last Raven you have the will to choose who you fight for. And they reference that here. Maybe. I don't know. Where's Chado at? If he was here, we'd know. I assume we're supposed to use that weapon in the next mission. Destroy the ice worm. Great. Can't wait. Okay, let's listen to the mission briefing. Uh, destroy the ice worm, a massive weapon deployed by the Planetary Closure Administration. Archibus will provide a prototype weapon to ensure the breach of the ice worm's coral shielding. Uh, it's the name of the weapon. Listen up, 621. This will be a joint operation led by Balaam and Archibus. The briefing's about to start. I want you to attend. I will, Vanda. First, some background before we go into detail. The intercorporate ceasefire is now in effect, and we will be carrying out coordinated attacks against the PCA. The targets are the enemy-occupied bases, the heavy warship fleet, and the recently activated... I'll cut to the chase. Uh this is an all-out war against the PCA in theaters across Rubicon. And you all got the short end of the stick. You're here to take on the worst of our dirty work, hunting the beast of the ice field. Sure thing, Chief. Tell you what, I'll watch and let you know how badly that goes for us. Gun 5, you just volunteered yourself for the front line. Moving on, let's talk about how we're going to neutralize the Ice Worm's Coral Shield. You'll be dealing with a layered barrier made up of a primary and a secondary shield. Archibus will provide the means to break the first layer. State-of-the-art stun needle launcher. Aim for the face, and it will deliver results, I assure you. What about the second layer? R.A.D.'s cooked up just the thing. A neat little toy we call the Overed Rail Cannon. 
If we divert the spaceport standby power to the ORC, it should hit hard enough. Assuming we land the shot. You can leave that to me. I know a thing or two about sharpshooting. I'll oversee operations on the ground. A ragtag crew like this needs leadership. We could use some more suppressive fire. I'll send Chatty. That just leaves the question of who will be taking charge of the stun needle launcher. I know just the volunteer to go poke that beast with a stick. <laughs> Gun 13, you get all that? Good, time for another field trip. Hell yeah. Oh wait, it lets you go on the mission without putting it on? Anyways. Okay, where's it at? All right, we're ready to go. Let's do it. It's not every day you see competing forces working together like this. Now we're never 621. Who's John Rubicon? Best mission so far? Oh, great. I'm excited for it. That guy does have good characterization. It's like what they were trying to do Armor Core for, but better. Agreed. It's time, 621. You ready? I guess, dude. I don't know. This mission depends upon you, Raven. Let's go. I'll be here to offer support. Oh, that's Nightfall. Okay. I love this dude. Outfit, you might oh my god, there's a worm here. Who's that creep think he is? I ain't here because I want to be. We gotta deal with those pesky shields first. Gun 13, roll out that fancy gizmo that Argibus paid the big bucks for. Well, we needed to stick its head out of the ground. We need to aim for the head. The rest of its body is covered in thick armor. This is V4 Rusty. The rail cannon is good to go. Don't die before I get a chance to fire, buddy. Tourist, got a message from the chief for you. Enjoy the show, and don't forget to smile. Come on, show me your face! Shit. Sighting correction A okay. 90, 95. I won't miss. Oh, that was sick. Secondary shield down. Gun 13, the head's open for a direct hit. All right, here we go. That freak actually did it. Did watch the bare minimum. This is just the first hurdle. The target's deployed drones, tourist. I'll handle them. All right, chatty. Play. I have to handle some of them, probably. Where's the worm? V4, load the next shell. One step ahead of you, Commander. Finally, someone with their head skirt on straight. Never thought about switching sides. <laughs> sure is an honor to be praised by the red guns hell on four legs. But I'll pass. There we go. Primary shield disabled. Shield loss confirmed. Preparing to fire rail cannon. 
Energy turbine output at 80%. This thing is sick. Output 95%. 100%. Watch out for friendly fire. That is so fucking cool. Secondary shield down. It's all yours now, buddy. Wait, something's wrong. I was so oh, shit. What? Fucking coral lightning. Oh, they're all dead? Here with me. Is that chatty? Taking significant damage. Might be checking out soon, tourist. Then run, brother. Oh, I should have fired then. Chatty, what are you doing, dude? Two repair kits remaining. Oh, it's behind me. Fuck. Oh god. It's bad. Where, where is your face at? Is it over there? Oh. Oh, shit. Too late. Half down. This primary shield is getting stronger. Stay cool, buddy. I'm fine, dude. It's all good. Got 13. What are you doing? Uh, a failure. All units retreat. Yeah, they didn't die. They got. I, th I think they get out somehow. How is Chatty still alive? Just zooming around. Very cool mission, though. Yeah, I fucked Main it up. It's fine. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. Michigan will take command. Commencing operation with combined AC force as per the Bela Markibus agreement. Move out, maggots! Time to die! That voice actor has so much fun with that role, and I love it. What does that creep think he is? I ain't here because I want to be. Deal with those pesky shields first. Gun 13, roll out that fancy gizmo that Argibus paid the big bucks for. I need to look at me. The, the rest of its body is covered in thick armor. This is V4 Rusty. The rail cannon is good to go. Oh, it's over there. Fuck. Don't die before I get a chance to fire, buddy. Tourist, got a message from the chief for you. Enjoy the show. And don't forget to smile. Come on. Oh, got it. Primary shield disabled. Shield loss confirmed. Oh, Initial I got tell it. Oh sequence. my god. Connecting EML modules. Opening energy turbines. Output at 80%. Sighting correction A OK. 90, 95. God, that is so fucking badass. Gun 13, the heads open for a direct hit. Woo. That freak actually did it. Oh, God. Did what? It's a bad minimum. This is just the first hurdle. The target's deployed drones, tourist. I'll handle them. V4, load the next 
eggshell. Come on. One step ahead of you, Commander. Finally, someone with their head skirt on straight. Never thought about switching sides. Sure is an honor to be praised by the Red Guns hell on four legs. Where's the worm? But I'll pass. Oh. Primary shield disabled. Shield loss confirmed. Preparing to fire rail cannon. Whew. Energy turbine output. I agree, Vanna. This mission's dope. It's so cool. Output 95%. Especially the first 100%. shot he fires. Where it goes like slow-mo and all the music stops. It's not really slow-mo, but the Watch music stops. He likes calling us buddy. Even while we're friends. I don't really know him that well. Wait, something's wrong. Fall back, six two one. I'm Coral lightning! This beast. The coral. It's out of control. Looks like things just took a nasty turn. I'll set the ORC to maximum output. We can't afford to lose control of the situation. This next shot will be my last. How are you way over there? Come here. No, wrong way. Oh, what the fuck are those things? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, I'm gonna die. I didn't die. This primary shield is getting stronger. Oh god. Stay cool, buddy. Don't forget to smile, tourist. We're taking significant damage. Might be checking out soon, tourist. Yeah, me too. AP Chatty. 50%. Primary shield down. Alright, there we go. Oh shit. What a worm. All or nothing. Woo, there it is, baby. That's so fucking badass. Got it! Oh god! Run away! Run away! Get clear! It's gonna blow! Woo. You shitting me? The freelancer really did it. Holy shit, dude! Here comes the sun, indeed. Damn! What a cool mission! That was sick. The whole thing. Badass. Fucking worms, dude. The blast will contaminate the area. Get out of <sighs> What's happening? Coral voices. Lost again. Raven. There's something I have to tell you. Okay. The coral. It's my family, my brothers and sisters. I am but a single wave born from the coral tide. All right, so it is the life stream. A Rubiconian without a body. No one even knew I was there for such a long time. Raven, you're the only one who... Yep. Go get your rest, 621. Things are going to get busy. Walter is very adamant we, we rest. You did good. Weird that the weak spot's also the hardest part of it. Right, because that's the drill, all of a sudden. That makes sense. 
literally just a live stream. And it really is, yeah. All right, that's the end of chapter three then. The temporary alliance between the Archivists and Balaam groups turned the tide of war. Hi, Ecker. Devastating the Planetary Closure Administration forces and exiling them from Rubicon. Though it was the Ice Worm mission led by Balaam that dealt the decisive blow, Archibus, through their own engagements with the PCA, augmented their strength with seized weaponry. The balance of power was broken, the scales tipped in Archibus's favor, and the Rubicon Liberation Front's hopes of fighting an exhausted foe were dashed. With the loss of their common enemy, the rival factions' war for the Coral abruptly reignited. And their bitter conflict burned with renewed intensity. Well, I wanted to help Balaam, not Archibus, but I guess... Okay, let's see what happens next then. Augmented Human, C4621, entering standard mode. Two new messages. Are we always inside of our AC? I feel like we are. Doing okay, 621. I'd wanted to let you rest some more, but the corpse are on the move already. With the PCA gone, it's back to work. Getting to where the coral's gathering. Do you remember the survey you carried out at Xylem? My friend analyzed the data and learned about a massive facility under the central ice field. Watch point Alpha. Turns out that the ice worm was defending the entrance to that place. It's time to let ourselves in. To be fair, you've given stupid good results. You are his prize winning pet. That is true. Raven, there's something you need to know. That friend Walter mentioned. The comms database has no record of the conversation he just told you about. This isn't about just finding the coral, Raven. He's after something more. And he's using you to do it. Not surprised. Here on Rubicon. Is this silent line? Very, th there's some similarities here for sure. Number RB23, call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. A rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. Oh shit. May these encounters further guide your technique. Nice. It is very, very silent line. I agree. All right, new mercenary data added and new parts. All right, before we end this episode, we'll check the parts out. New linear rifle, hell yes. Well, it only has 360 rounds, which we'll never go through anyway, but it's new and it's probably better. Hell yeah. A new machine gun that looks like a legit machine gun now. Uh, a new handgun that's long, a <laughs> fucking big ass handgun right there. Check the shop, boys, it's time to poke. Uh, the Sampu, which is a burst handgun. Little gem, new bazooka! Jamming bomb launcher. A new laser rifle. That looks sick, actually. I like that a lot. A laser shotgun. That looks really cool as well. All right, what do we got? Now, now what I actually care about, the laser lance. And we have, we have the explosive thrower as well. Well, I mean, I mean, come on, guys. That's a big ass weapon, too. <laughs> Same thing, machine gun, all that kind of stuff. There's nothing really different on this side then. Back weapons, we got a spread bazooka. Hell yeah. Laser cannon, pulse, uh, pulse shield launcher. Another missile launcher, a uh, split missile launcher. Uh, oh, the new version of the active, active homing missiles that fires two instead of one and some new plasma missiles, and a laser turret. So it's like an orbit almost. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna just grab the funnels right now. And on this side, we got a spread bazooka. Same thing. Oh, this is the new launcher, right? Um, Paul Shield launcher, missile launcher. So it's all the same then. 
Headwise, though, we got the the barrel. The, uh, what is this? The VE44A, and that's it. Two new heads. And with that, we also got the VE40A, which is a complete upgrade for us. And that is 100% a reference to Armored Core 2, I think. I'm fairly certain. This looks extremely familiar. Give me that. Also comes with new arms that look like they're out of a uh, Armored Core 4 or 4 answer. And the Sasabi legs. <laughs> Heavyweight bipedal legs. We're not going to run those, but that's still cool. Oh, we got some new uh, quadruped legs or tetrapods. We're going to buy those for Wanzer. Uh, some new boosters that are better at everything except for the quick boost thrust, which I kind of like our quick, quick boost thrust the way it is now. Uh, any new FCSs? I don't think so. A new generator that's actually an upgrade all around. That's what we have on. We'll buy that. Oh, wait. Oh, I didn't buy any of the stuff that I actually wanted. All right, now we have the stuff that I want. Okay, so first off, the Curtis is getting replaced with the Harris. Uh, we're going to keep that. We're going to drop that, obviously, and put on um, that again. And then on our on this side, we're going to put this on. And then we're going to put our new core on. Do I want this new core? I think I do. Our speed is going down. Oh, it's a heavyweight core. Mm, I don't know about that then right now. So the energy recharge is pretty bad on this, actually. Oh, but we go into an energy shortfall now. Damn, that sucks. That actually pulls us out of there. We lose a lot of speed. I have the laser lance on our, on our back right now, Amanda. Question, you have, have you unlocked the ability to have multiple uh, side weapons when they run out of ammo? You're still early in the game, but was curious. Uh, yeah. Multiple arm weapons, you mean? There's not hanger parts, but there are multiple arm weapons you can equip. Better AP, lower stability, lower load limit. Upgrading weapons is like when you when you give a mouse a cookie situation, yeah. I don't like these legs very much. At all, actually. Well, yeah, we, I essentially have been building an Armored Core 3 mech the entire time. I want to go see what this looks like, though. I'm not a fan of these legs at all. All right, they don't look that bad in the field, I suppose. Oh, I like that. Dude, hold on. Oh, that is so cool. I love everything about that. Oh, the problem is our legs. I don't like them. 
We can put a shittier generator on, but I don't really want to do that. I gotta get used to the charge time on this one. God, that is such so badass. All right, we gotta tune this up a little bit, but before we do that, if you're watching on YouTube, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon. We'll, we'll be back next time with probably a tweaked out AC a little bit, or a tuned up AC, I guess. And I'll see you then. Peace.